The first 72 hours are arguably the most critical. In that time, everything inside these two sheds needs to be on a ship and out to sea. It's a race against time. When that clock starts, months of scheduled maintenance, diligent planning and operational training are put to the test as a carefully choreographed dance of cranes, trucks, ships, people and planes begins. Whether it's an exercise or a real submarine rescue mission, when that countdown begins, we must be absolutely certain we're ready to go. self-sufficient local team has mobilised both intervention and rescue systems. With operators from our global pool now on board, it's time to head to sea for what will be JFD's 10th Black Carillion submarine rescue exercise. The first day at sea is always a reminder that submarine rescue is about so much more than just delivering equipment. On an exercise like this, today is about the people. With more than 35 years of submarine rescue backing them, JFD's team is among the world's most experienced operators. Every exercise is an opportunity to improve, to develop procedures, to find new ways of working and ultimately to enhance the capabilities of the system. Today, they put it all to the test in a series of regular and emergency simulations designed to systematically prove the capability of the system and the proficiency of our operators. Capabilities demonstrated, it's time to transit to deeper waters. Exercises like Black Carillion provide vital opportunity to prepare for the unfortunate by building on lessons learned during previous exercises and collaborating with industrial and naval partners. This year we're working with our American and Japanese counterparts to practice simultaneous operation of multiple rescue systems in shared water space on a single disabled submarine.
Once more, Black Carillion has pushed the boundary of what is possible in submarine rescue. The James Fisher Submarine Rescue System is not only the smallest, lightest and most portable in its class, but thanks to regular exercises like this, it's also one of the most capable. As the largest and longest serving commercial provider of escape and rescue services, we are dedicated to those who serve subsea.